This is the Speak for Yourself app, and this is how to change the voice on the Speak for Yourself app. What you're going to do is, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put a sentence in here so that we could see that how you can change the different voices. So the first thing I am going to say is, I want to talk to you. Okay, so you have the sentence. I want to talk to you. Okay, and you see that was kind of fast. What you can do is, to change the voices, you're going to go up in the upper right hand corner here to this little daisy looking thing, and you're going to touch that. And you see your voice here is Catherine. These are the Sarah Proc voices, by the way. And um, what you're going to do is you're going to change the rate, and you can make it slower, or you can make it faster and you can change the pitch here. So if you're working with a child and you want that voice to be a little higher, so it's a more childlike voice, you can do that. And then you can go back here to options and you can, you can touch anywhere outside of that to close out of that box. So now when you say, I want to talk to you. You can hear it's a little bit. I want to talk to you. You can do that. You can even slow it down a little bit more and go to extra slow. I want to talk to you. Or you can make it faster. I want to talk to you. And that's a little bit too fast. <laughs> um, so I'm going to just leave it at medium. I want to talk to you. Okay, so we're going to clear that out. And I probably should have left it, but we can always say something else. I can say. I. something to say. I have something to say. Okay, so there's our voice we're going to, now we're going to change it to a different voice and there are five voices in here that you can choose from. So we're going to choose Adam and we'll leave it medium and we'll leave it, and let's just put it at high instead of extra high. I have something to say. Okay, so you have that, which is kind of a younger younger voice. I have something to say. Or you can put it like that. And you can change it. There's also um, William here who has a British accent. I have something to say. But you can't hear it too much there. And you could change it to Sarah. I have something to say. There you go, and she has a little bit of a British accent, but you get the idea, and you can kind of play around with the voices, um, changing the pitch and the rate until they sound like the age of the person that you're working with.